What's up you guys? Today is Friday, which means it's half off the entire store at Rethink Thrift. We're gonna run in here and see what we can find to flip for a profit. All right, so these made it to half off day, so I'm gonna get these for one of you guys. Uh, these are very useful for cleaning stuff. So I looked these up yesterday. They are all new. This uh, Wen by Chaz Dean. And now that they've made the half off day, they're gonna be worth buying. They weren't worth buying at full price. Okay, so you guys know I'm not big into picking up glassware, but this Pyrex was just in such good condition and it's $5. I Google Lens it, it's the Crazy Daisy model and it looks like I can get between 40 and 50 for it. So I'm gonna buy it. Okay, this must have just got put out after walking in because I looked at this whole thing. Uh, but this is gonna be a buy for sure for a five. Over in the glass case is this bag of like Motorola walkie talkies for four dollars. So that's gonna be a buy. Some of these can be really good. And some of these can be really good too if they're new. Hmm. Okay, so the the disc is in here for $1.25. I'm gonna take a chance on it. I've sold some of these for 30 up to like you know a hundred. Over in the shoes are these Dansko sandals. They're gonna be 350. Good condition. Not the best model, but they'll sell for 25 to 30. So when I first got here, I grabbed these two just because they're sealed and put them in the cart. Looked them up, this is gonna be $2.50 and it goes for about 20 and it sells very consistently. And this being new goes for about 30 to 40 and it's only gonna be 350. Finally, a haul that's not just a bunch of shoes, am I right? Okay, that was a pretty good stop. Not a lot of quantity. I mean, I got some quantity. I only spent, I think it was $34 on everything. I think maybe 39, but I think it was 34 because I had a $5 off punch card uh, that I used. I have like six $5 punch cards for this place because of how much I spend here. Um, but yeah, as you saw, the Pyrex, all of these uh, Wen by Chaz Dean cleansing conditioners and they go for they're not big money they go for 15 to 20 a piece but they're like two dollars a piece here being half off i showed you guys both of these sets the don't look don't pass up uh box sets of any kind of dvds just scan the code even if it's used they can be big money used those weren't going for a lot of money that's why i bought them because they were new i got the dance goes this will be going to one of you guys soon in my first whatnot auction when I hit 5,000 subscribers. And like, these are great. I hook them up to my drill and I use them to clean the soles of shoes and it really gets in there, really gets all the dirt out. It's, they're fantastic. So I'll probably give those away in the show like for free. Cause I wanna thank you guys. And then I got these, I didn't look this up yet. And the TV, which is gonna go for about a hundred. 100 bucks, maybe more depending on the model. Now we are off to Goodwill. And stay tuned till the end because there's also an estate sale that I went to yesterday. Did pretty good there. We are now at my local Belgrade Goodwill. First find are these Keen Utility Boots. And I mean, they're not in terrible condition and they are only 10, but I'm gonna leave them behind. They're just a little too warm. I'm not gonna get this, but that's, that's really funny. It's got the tusk and everything. <laughs> I wasn't finding a lot, but in the women's jackets, I found these Burton snow pants for $7 and they should sell for about 40. Good condition. All right, first find of the stops, like the real find is this Allied Time AT2500, like punch in, punch out uh, clock. I looked it up, I couldn't find this exact model, but similar ones by same brand are selling like between 100 and 150. Uh, some were selling for 60 to 75, so I'm not sure exactly how much I'll get for it, but I'm gonna take a chance. And this Brookstone Massager came off the same card as well. It is eight bucks, which is paying up, but they sell pretty consistently for 40 to 50. Okay, so some of these North Face trail running shoes can be really good. 13 is just a little too high for them. You could probably get 40 to 45 once you clean them up, but I'm gonna leave them. Only ended up getting the three things, the snowboard pants, this clock, and the massager, $26, not bad. Don't look in here, that's a sneak peek at an estate sale. Okay, next stop of the day is gonna be Four Corners Thrift. Uh, TI-83 Plus. These aren't as valuable as the 84s, but they do sell for about 20 to 25 pretty quick. Okay guys, scan your barcodes. I remember I selling something by Polar, one of these watches in the past, and it sold for good money, so I scanned it. It's eight bucks. The most recent one sold on eBay for 60 free shipping. Very lightweight, first class, so that's a buy. So they've got some tools in, but I just, 
I don't know a lot about tools. Tools is one category I want to learn more about. Hopefully this summer start buying them at yard sales for cheap because it's Montana. Everyone has tools. But let me know if any of this is something you guys would have picked up. I mean, this is cool. It's like Stanley, you know, steel master tape measure, but. And I know some of these can be worth good money. I remember seeing them in some people's videos, but they they wrote two dollars each on them, so I don't I don't know why they would do that instead of just use their stickers. There's some putters. Let's see what they are. Tour Edge and Ray Cook. Yeah, I don't think those are gonna be anything special. Okay, I only ended up getting the TI-83 Plus and the Polar Sports Watch. Uh, $13 for both. Like I said, I should get $60 for the Sports Watch and $25 for the calculator. And the calculator will sell really fast. So, I mean, not a lot of quantity, but good quick selling stuff. The last stop before we hop into some estate sale footage is do-over thrift. All right, this might be worth 10. This is the lower end model of the Aero Garden Grow systems, but these do sell well. I'll have to look up the exact model in a bit to make sure it's worth 10, but I think it's gonna be a buy. These though are 100% a buy, PF flyers for 10. These will sell very quickly for 40 to 50. Those are like Converse, but more expensive and better. Over here are some Croc slip-on shoes. Ah, they're 10 bucks. These might be worth it. I'll have to look up the model. They might, I think these are like $30 shoes. All right, I almost missed these. These are definitely a buy for 10. Vivo Barefoot. This is a very high-end brand you want to look out for. They always sell really good, really fast for like 50 bucks. All right, this would be good, but they have it marked at 125, so I'm obviously not paying that much for it. Uh, this would sell for about 150. But this I will pay $10 for. It's one of the lower end ones, but I'll still be able to sell the, you know, the pitcher for 30, the lid for 20, and the shoot for 10, um, and the base probably for 20 to 25. All right, this is a score for 25. I've never heard of this brand, Ocean Blue, but these canister vacuums always part out fantastic. 75 for the power nozzle, you know, 50 for the hose, 75 for the motor. That's great. I found these and I thought they were going to be good being sealed for seven a piece, but they only sell for about 15 to 20 a piece and seven bucks just not worth the time. This helmet is going to be a score for seven dollars. If you see them with the visor, that usually adds quite a bit of value to them. New, this sells for $175. Used, I can get probably 80 to 100. And in here are these Annan ski goggles for five. Annan's a great brand to sell. Uh, these are probably worth at least 30. Oh man, there's another pair. I know the season for this is pretty much over, but they do sell year round. And, you know, not a lot of people are listing them because the season's over. So I won't have a lot of competition. Oakley ones are pretty good, but seven, and that's an old model. I am going to put this back. This one only goes for about 30, but those are something you want to look out for. They can be big money. All right, $72 spent on everything. I'll get the money back just on the helmet. I mean, that's a nice helmet, great condition. Uh, the vacuum's an awesome score. The Vivo Barefoot, any barefoot shoes sell good, uh, but Vivo Barefoot's probably like one of the top selling ones. And these are like new. They might actually even be new. They look like they've never been worn. They still have the stickers, so that's awesome. If those are new, that's probably 75 on its own. Great stop. And that's going to wrap up the thrifting portion of today. Let's hop right into the estate sale. We are at an estate sale on a Thursday. Just walk in. Oh. Hi. 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 Very close and it got cold. <laughs> cool. Oh, yeah. Welcome. How are you guys today? Good. How are you? Good. Oh, good. Feel, feel free just yep. to wander. Sorry, okay. that's my oh. first. <laughs> just anywhere? So, anywhere in this or? room, everything's a dollar. Okay, um, except, I like that. <laughs> yep, except for like these, oh, this, sorry, sorry about just going there. Um, these, <laughs> these are like 15 bucks for the pair. Okay. okay. These tables nice. are even for sale for a different price, obviously. Okay. Um, pretty much everything and everything in here. Okay. Pretty much a dollar. How um, much would you have on the tables? Some nice, nicer stuff in the yeah. kitchen. Oh, okay. that's a different price. Possibly okay. for what yeah. nachos. How much did you have on the tables? Um, well, we haven't really discussed the tables, but I want to say they're going to be like 
40 bucks probably, 40 okay. to 60 dollars. Yeah. The small one, the bigger one. Okay. Yeah. I could even wait till you guys are done with the sale and then yeah. maybe swing by and pick They're them up. They're great and, tables, yeah. right? You, you want I'd, them? I'd be I'm, interested in like this one for... It's a great size. Yeah. It's, yeah. I, I like, it's not like long, but it's like wider. Yep. And, yep. It's a great size. And the huge entertainment center that is very up to date. Oh Everybody gosh. loves it. Okay. It's awesome. <laughs> We're also looking to get that. Sounds good. <laughs> How much do you have on the old iPhones? Oh, a dollar. Everything. In oh, yeah, a dollar. Everything a dollar. Yep. Yep. Dig away. We got boxes and stuff too. If you guys right. are accumulating some stuff. Sounds we good. tend to accumulate, so. Oh. The... Is this a toothbrush blender? Oh my god, what you got this for Austin? I think that's a picky bank. Or no, it has a slot in the head, but... But why is there holes? I don't know. Oh my god, so is this going to be some beautiful band-aids? What if I do this to Austin? Really congratulations on getting into yeah. residency. Yeah, he'd, hey, I mean, Austin. he'd probably like it. I don't know if he's actually What do you watching. think? <laughs> so I get a... I know these things... Like people sell stuff like this. I don't know if it, I've never sold anything like this, but since it's so cheap, I'll probably get it. I might as well just grab the basket too. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Little bell. Dinner's ready. Hello. You want a duck? A duck? Oh my god. It's too big for you guys to start collecting. Oh, that is works. That good? Yeah. Well, okay, it's perfect. What is this? Like, is it a piggy bank? Is it... There's holes in it? You know, I don't know if it's her stuff. She just got to lose bones. I think it... Oh, really? So it's her stuff. I don't know what it is for her husband. The boys are in the medical field. So... When she's off the phone, I'm sure she'll make it. Okay, yeah. I would love to know. <laughs> That'd be so funny. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to grab your candle holders. Oh, you, okay. So, so you know what these are? These yeah. Glasses? So do you see the glass that goes through? The glass? I did not see it. Okay. These are the different expanses that go with like the oh, different perfect. ones. Yeah. I don't know if they're 100 percent all match. Yeah. Okay. But these go with that. Oh, you're buying those. You're buying this. Sure, I'll take them. <laughs> I I didn't even realize they came with them. I thought you just yeah. stuck it in and. No, nope, that's perfect. We just kind of kept them. Yeah. It's just easier to kind of put them in a box. Like all right. This. Yeah, I'll definitely take them. Thank you. Oh my god, I didn't think I'd ever get them. It was pot. Was it? Oh yeah. It's like um. Stainless steel from Japan. You're stainless steel from Japan. Well, you know what that is, right? It's a burner. No, no, no. It's it's um. Hanju. Hanju pot. Hanju. 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 So oh, yeah, this is hard. Hard. Um, and then we have some stuff. I never did. Okay. I had hoped it. I, I kind of thought if we waited one um, Saturday, I think she'll be home. We have this shelf, um, $80 the best offer. And then we have like this little thing in here. A tackle box? Yeah, but it's a tackle box of like. Okay, like sewing stuff? Mm -hmm. no. Or, no. Like home stuff. Ah. <laughs> So yeah, you missed the right. AC, unit we sold. Yeah. Shovel. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, cool. Yeah, so that's all that's in there. Yeah. Not a whole lot, but um it's about is, there, is there anything it's in there or just just out? Okay. Yeah, it's all out here. And Zillow's showing our listing it for sixty. So the these are all storage already stuff. Storage already. Yeah. Yeah. Cookie cutters, she made.
I did see it. <gasps> see that camera? That's pretty cool. Whoa. Look what this is. Nobody knows what this is. But you put it on your page so you can read at night. Okay. That's pretty That's what you, you that's could use them like that. I could use one like that. It's kind of handy, huh? There's like, a flash drive right here. I don't know if you guys... Oh, oh, yeah. I like pretty much anything. <laughs> I'm gonna put phone with it too. You want the light thing, Jess? We're at 19, trying to find one more thing to make it even 20. Mm. Alright. Well, Lord of the Nope. Duck. Lord of the Rings Motion Trilogy. Perfect. Okay, everybody would agree with me. The duck. Right. See, the thing is. It's up. What would we do with it? Oh, that's a pineapple pill. Sorry to change the topic on you, but I think I'm all set. All right, we found two more things. Okay. Even 20. Did you get the doctor? What? Yeah. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. A little condensed. Thank you. What? What is Okay, not bad. Everything was a dollar each. I I know nothing about brass candle holders, but I know they do sell. I'll probably sell them in lots and whatnot because I, I know myself, I'll never get around to listing them. But I got iPhone S. Um, that's probably a $30, $40 phone on its own. I'm not exactly sure what model of phone this is, but for a dollar, I got the Sony headphones. And you guys should have seen comps for everything. The Lord of the Rings trilogy. And I just grabbed the Panasonic uh, cordless phone set, the two phones and chargers for a dollar, just to make it an even twenty. And just got a doctor. We're protecting Austin. <laughs> it's, we're just Austin is her uh, brother-in-law, and he's he's a doctor. The, yeah. yeah. So, <laughs> cool.